All right, folks, got me some diodynamic LED bulbs <clears throat> for the back new LED tinted um, lights. Because the ones that are on there, you really can barely see anything. Let me show you what I mean. Oh, yeah, you like my blue lights inside? I think it looks pretty cool. This is what it kind of looks like right now. So, let me show you what it looks like after I install them. So, in order to do this, let me get my handy dandy. lost it there <clears throat> because it comes with this cheap bulb here which you can't really see anything so I'm gonna come over here try new <clears throat> bulbs these bulbs are good they're expensive, uh, to be honest. Um, they're 90 bucks, and I know you're probably saying, "Holy crap! Why 90 bucks?" Well, they are. Where is it at? <clears throat> I want to say they're 510 luminous. You can get ones for 40, uh, ones for 60, and then these are the most expensive coat, of course. I want to get the best for my car, so I am going to get the most expensive. And it should fit right in. Alright, should be it. Let me see if they work real quick. Come right back here. There's that one. Oh yeah, holy crap. These things are bright. And compare that one to that one. Whoa. I'll show you the comparison when I get a... <coughs> Shut it back down, huh? <sighs> I'm gonna need probably both hands for this. I might be able to do it just like this. Let me see. There we go. This goes there. This one goes there. This one goes there. <coughs> I lost the screw. Where did I screw go? Oh, there it goes on the floor. Sorry about this video. I'm trying to do this one handed video. I don't know how people do that. I'm trying to learn. You don't want to go too far in and crack it. You want to go just enough. This is what the new bulbs look like. The one on the right is the Diode Dynamics 510, I want to say, Luminous, which look awesome compared to the uh, left one. As you can see, came with the uh, only the lenses, which really suck. I mean, look at that. From angle, what a difference. <clears throat> Going over here to the regular stock bulbs. 
You can look. Looks like it's not even on. That's how crappy they look. Big, big difference. All right, folks. So I'm back today. Uh, trying to finish this video with the bulbs that I put in LEDs. They were hyper flashing. Um, so I kind of googled and told me to buy a flasher. So I bought this Noveta EP26 uh, flasher um, and see if it worked. I never tried them before and actually it does. Uh, so glad that it did. I think I paid 10 bucks for it on Amazon. If you're interested to know, let me know and I'll put the link below. But um, I, I'm not used to doing these videos. I gotta get used to them. I wanted to show you when I installed it, but of course I didn't. Um, let me go get my flashlight. It goes underneath the dash. Uh, it's too hot out here. It's about 100 degrees. So I kind of did a half-assed job. So if you go underneath the dash, um, let's see if I can go up here and you can see. Where's it at? All right. You can see up there. Where is it? Okay. That's the... The old one, which I gotta pull out because it's for the screw. The new one is hanging right in front of my face. That big old block right there. Uh, I unplugged that one, but it's screwed onto the steering column. But like I said, it's too hot out here to take it out, so I'm gonna take it out probably next week. And here's the other one, the new one. Um, put it in there, and actually. I'm very happy with the results because when I put the key in the ignition and turn it on, I'm more happy for it. 